Yeah, I mean, uh, I wasn't sure after the second set how much uh, was left in the tank, and um, so you know, it was a a good battle until then. Um, I feel like I needed to maybe pace myself ever so slightly um, at that moment, especially emotionally, of not pressing too hard and wanting it too badly. So may maybe just get a bit more uh, mellow and relaxed about things and just um, go with the flow a little bit, let the experience take over. And then see how I feel later. As I know, in best of five set matches, you always have moments where you feel better and worse. Um, so yeah, I mean, uh, now, that's not the question, really. The question is, uh, how do I feel after uh, about winning? I know if I was worried, to be honest. Uh, I tried to be really motivated uh, and and see what what could be done. Uh, I knew it was a big match for me uh, to back it up after Chilic, and uh, still, um, you are on center court in Paris. Uh, it's where you always wanted to be as a, as a little boy, and you tried to remind yourself many, many times, but. You know, I appreciate battles like these, you know, especially on clay, you rarely have so many tight sets, you know, at, at some point you do break and run away with it or the opponent does the same. So um, I thought uh, I, I appreciated that battle and I thought uh, Dominic played a great match and um, I, hope he, I hope he does well the rest of the year. Yes, I mean, it's, uh, it's fun in some ways, not knowing, uh, like in, in 17 when I came back or when nobody really knows, even myself, doesn't know what is possible, you know. So that's it's got a, fa a fun angle, but I would prefer it differently, you know. I prefer it to be in Rafa's or Novak's shoes right now, where they're like, I'm, I'm feeling good, you know. If I'm playing well, I'm winning. So uh, I don't have that feeling right now. So for me, it's um, uh, this, this, these are all stepping stones, right, to something uh, that is really important to me. It's the season and it's uh, the comeback. And uh, I need matches like these, you know. Um, we go through these matches, you know, we analyze them highly and uh, look on what's next. And we'll do the same um, uh, to tonight and tomorrow uh, latest because I need to decide if I, if I keep on playing or not or is it not too much risk at this, at, at this moment to keep on pushing, you know, or is this just the perfect way um, to just take a rest because I don't have the week in between here and Halle um, like normal to see like how, what, what's best now if you count back from Wimbledon and so forth. So it's just um, a lot going on, you know, but uh, Having a match like this, knowing I could have probably played a fifth set, um, but not knowing how I will wake up tomorrow is um, is interesting to say the least. So, um, yeah, it's uh, definitely a different time right now for me. Berettini, what do you want to know? I told you I don't know if I'm going to play, so I don't know what to tell you. So uh, I have to find out. I'm happy for him, he won, but uh, I will d discuss with the team and then I go from there. Uh, so, yeah, okay. Ciao, ciao.